25th anniversary of TNT9 in northern Tasmania, tonight Janine Rogers takes a look at the life and times of the great Tasmanian lady of politics, Dame Enid Lyons. Born in a small hamlet near Smithton in 1897, Dame Enid Lyons rose to become an influential member of federal parliament and the community, gaining the love and respect of all Tasmanians. Following the death of her husband, Sir Joseph Lyons, the state's only Prime Minister, Dame Enid became the first woman member of the House of Representatives, winning the seat of Darwin, now Braddon, for the United Australia Party in 1943. She went on to become Australia's first woman Cabinet Minister. After resigning from politics because of ill health in 1951, she served as an ABC Commissioner for 11 years and wrote three books. Dame Enid Lyons died on September 2, 1981, aged 84. Her funeral was the biggest scene in Devonport for many years. 600 mourners, including a large contingent of federal and state politicians, led by acting Prime Minister Doug Anthony and Premier Doug Lowe, packed Our Lady of Lourdes Catholic Church and lined the streets outside to say goodbye to Dame Enid. Before her death, she told how she would like to be remembered. Oh, I'd like them to think that I was a, a person who thought of other people and not too much of myself. I'm going to Northern Tasmania from St. Helens.